Hi guys, I'm here again. This time I'm going to be working on this picture. Um, I was actually kind of following along with uh, Jessica from Jessica's Coloring Corner on YouTube. Um, she's using polychromos, but I don't have polychromos. I have five polychromos. <laughs> That's all I have so far. So I'm using Prismas um, for the majority. And here I'm using, um, what are they, the Statler? Yeah. Stedler, Stedler. These guys here, I don't know if you can see it. No, I can't really see. Just a tad too high for me. Um, I tried to bring the camera down a little bit lower. Um, I don't really know how to zoom in and out. Well, I probably do, but I'll probably mess everything up. So what a busy day. What a busy day so far. Not really, but yes. <laughs> it's 12 on a Monday. I am not at work today because I had taken today off. So it's a gorgeous day. I'm looking out my window. I just love spring. Spring's my favorite time of the year. Um, it's, so, it's so pretty. I love the spring green. So the last time I was, last video, I was decoupaging a lid. So I want to show you, I'm going to do one more coat. And I was noticing <clears throat> uh, let's see, I don't know if it's everywhere that was I was thinking pink, but I think everywhere that was a lighter color besides the blue and the green turned kind of an orange color instead of pink or let me find the napkins. Yeah, <clears throat> so here's the napkin. And so like all the faces turned orange, uh, most of the, yeah, it just, everything turned orange, which is okay, it's still brighten, but I need to do like one more coat, because you can still see the C's candy stuff through, and <coughs> um, I noticed I wasn't putting down the Mod Podge first and then the napkin on all of them because some of them are a little bit puffy so you can like tell it's like oh there's no Mod Podge in there to glue it down but that's okay it's okay so I need one more coat on that and then I'll be done with that now <laughs> let's talk about the dork that I am sometimes okay Remember, I was talking about how I couldn't edit my videos and stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, that's true on this computer, but I forgot that I had a laptop, and the laptop has everything already on it. So, <laughs> I was talking to my sister yesterday, um, you know, face to face on our phones. Um, and we were like talking about different things and that popped in my head. It's like, what a dork. I could have used that and edited my videos. But anyway, I did purchase, um, from a company called Cyberlink. Ugh. Cyberlink. And so I purchased Power Director 16 Ultimate. And it has 50, it has a library of 50 sound effects. Um, Auto Director 7 Ultra. Huh? And Cyberlink Cloud. Anyway, our church uses this program, and so he's the one who told me uh, told me about this program. So I thought, cool. It's not that expensive. I mean, kinda, but it's on sale, so 
It was less than a hundred dollars. And so I got that sorted out. So it's it's got a bunch of files. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen files. Nice. And I'm on downloading the first file, which is the biggest one, I believe. Anyway, so I got an hour till that one's downloaded. So it's fun times for me. And I guess I should color as I talk. So our baby chicks that we have in the incubator are hatching. Get my grab my pens over here. This is out of Joanna Basford's um Lost Ocean. And so anyway, they're hatching and Bunch of cute little chicks in there. <laughs> uh, I don't know what color I want to do. Pink and purple sound good over here. What pinks and purples do I have? I have this and this. Um, and this, let's see. So two pinks and two purples. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I'll do these two. I might have to be turning my uh, my stuff around too. Get this out of the way. This is what I use to uh, uh, put my phone on or my tablet actually and talk to my sister. That's fun. <laughs> At least I get to talk to her. She's in California and I'm up here in Washington. What color do I want to do that? Ah, oh, so many. Maybe I should use the brightest pink there and there. All right. I'll use the. Man. What do I want to use a different color? Blue. What am I hearing? Be quiet. That's my printer. Uh, so, so what are you guys doing? I am enjoying this day. I am glad that the rain is gone for a little bit. It might rain on Friday. They said there's a chance of rain, but that changes daily. I wanted a brighter blue. Uh, Oh well. Oh well. So, um, I was watching Anne from A Colorful Life, and she was actually, oh, I was watching some pr uh, previous videos from January. She was coloring out of Magical Jungle. And I had finished some pictures, a whip. I finished a whip and I did another picture. So I think I did a three pictures, pages out of Romantic Country One. Uh, one that I was following along with uh, Julie's Passions for Pencils and I did a background in water watercolors um, but I didn't like how it came out I need practice got to keep practicing practicing with uh, your watercolors um, so I just didn't like the way it turned out so I thought I was gonna make like a halo effect around the castle that's in this picture and 
and learned how to do that. That's why that's why I bought the um uh, polychromos that I do have. Cause who was it now? Man, I can't think of what her name is. But she was showing you how to do uh, wings. Kind of transparent-y, kind of... I don't know if they're transparent or not either. They're pastel -y looking wings. And so I ordered the colors that she was using so I could... I didn't have the same book, but I had a fairy book. So I could practice on the wings. Anyway, so I thought... Well, I'll do that kind of effect around this castle. Because um, that's where the majority of the issue I had. Oh, did I miss it there? Is my head in the picture? <laughs> it probably is. I get really close because I'm blind. <laughs> and I got my glasses on, but still, this is tiny stuff. And normally, what I do... Like I've mentioned before, I have a magnifying glass. And I actually got one. It's not the best. But it comes on a stand. So I can just, you know, turn it the way I want so I can see it. See? And so I use that. But since I'm doing this video, um, that wouldn't be a good idea. So I'm trying to do these tiny little s places without it, and it's kind of hard because I'm wearing trifocal glasses, but you gotta look through one spot to see closer up, and that's interesting. Those of you who have trifocals understand. Or even if you have bifocals, you probably understand. Ugh. I don't want to go out the lines because it makes it messy. So, I ended up going to the bank today. Because I was having problems logging into my online account. Because I was going to... Well... I did it wrong. <laughs> I, was, I read the thing wrong uh, to purchase this um, editing software. You can do it by your bank account, PayPal, or it said transfer. But I didn't see the bank account piece. So I hit transfer because I didn't want to do PayPal. And I couldn't log in. <laughs> well, it turns out I was, when I went to the bank today to try and figure out what was going on, I learned that I was adding too many numbers to my account number. I was like, oh, that's probably what I did. <laughs> so I figured that piece out. And so then I asked them, well, can, since I'm here, can we just transfer this? And there was going to be a $10 charge for a, a wire transfer, because that's what they would do. And I said, okay, well, all right. Um, and then it turns out, well, they wanted the wire transfer was going to go to Germany, so that would be international. And so that was going to be 35 And I was like, Ugh. okay, no, never mind. I'll just come home and I'll do it. I'll do it, uh, oh, let's finish this piece. I'll just finish it off when I get home. So, I'm glad I didn't do that. Um, because I went back on to the thing. And it said, uh, you have seven days to do this transfer thing. Well, um, so anyway, I went back on it and it's like, it kept saying $89. It was still on sale. So it was over $100. And it's like, but I was being charged basically $70. So I think, what's the difference in the pay? And so everything looked the same, but I have a feeling what I actually clicked on was not. 
right. Um, and I don't know for sure, but so I scrolled all the way down to the bottom of the page and went to the different you know, things they had there to click on. And so I went there and did it that way, but it was $89. And then that's when I saw the bank account thing. And the bank, when I was there, they were kind of, are you sure this is legit and everything? I'm like, yeah. <clears throat> and may, I don't know, but the first link I hit, which had the same information, I just didn't see it. Um, it was at the top of the page, and you know sometimes when you go to things, uh, sites, they have things, you know, around the place want you to click on there. It's like, I don't know if that was one of them or not, but, but it was, you know, $20 cheaper, so maybe it was. <clears throat> So anyway, I spent the $89 instead of $69. <laughs> and now I'm downloading it. And I got a <coughs> like a frog in my throat. So yesterday my son Craig came over. And his wife, Charlie. And they, uh, well, Craig was supposed to come over to help my husband with the incubator, the largest one, <clears throat> to put it up higher because the lockdown part where the eggs were hatching was down, down at the bottom, so you had to, like, you know, get on the floor so you can see what was going on down there. Um, so he was supposed to help him, but he didn't show up until like 3, and he said he'd be over at noon. So, uh, my husband got a hold of our neighbor, and he came over and helped us, or helped him. I wasn't here. <clears throat> anyway, Craig, as a co-worker who's got eggs, uh... They're a banty chicken, and I can't remember what breed what breed they were. But anyway, he want wanted to incubate those, so we gave him one of our incubators to use. I'm not sure why he gave him the white one. We have a yellow one, and a white one, and the big giant one. <laughs> That he gave him the white one to use. I think, I mean, it worked because as we did our first batch in there this year, this season. Um, but it's styrofoam, so it's just harder to clean out. So that could be the reason why he let him use that one because the yellow one is easier to clean out because it's all plastic. Hmm, I'm not going to see that. This color. Oh, it's too close to the blue. Dang it. Oh, well, live and learn. I don't know, guys, how you guys do this, but this is how I do it. Little tiny pieces. Straining to look out from the bottom of my glasses. We're at the bottom of my glasses because that's the portion I have to look out of if I'm reading or something, which is ridiculous. Is it? Yeah. Bottom. Which, you know, it strains my eyes still. So I love to read. I got two books I'm trying to read, but I can't read for very long because my eyes are like, you know, try looking down. You know, look straight forward and then look down and that's what I have to do so my eyes get tired faster and you can't look up because you're looking through a different part of your glasses and I can no longer read without my glasses which I did that for many years you 
end up getting gestational diabetes with my second and third child. So I had to get glasses. I realized I could no longer see the clock at work. And that's what he said. It's like, oh. So I did really good during that time. But he told me to do something about my weight or it would come back and it wouldn't be gestational, which it did. Yay for me, because I didn't lose the weight. Well, I did a few times, not all the way. <laughs> but that's how it goes, up and down. So I did that, went to the bank, and then later, after that, I went to Fred Meyer grocery store, which is the same as Kroger. So if you have Kroger, that's the same kind of store. They bought Fred Meyer, I guess. Still has the same name though. But stuff in there says Kroger. So I went there to pick up a few things. Cause I want, wanted to get back here. To get this downloaded because I knew it was going to take a long time. Just like my Sims games when I want to purchase something. I still want a physical copy of everything though. Well, this I won't, but like with my Sims games, I want a physical copy. Because the majority of my stuff is downloaded. Um, so I came home, checked on the chickens, let the kitties outside, later on, like around three, I'll go check on the chickens, my husband takes care of the pigs and the cows, check on the chickens, gather the eggs, feed and water, um, and then I gotta go to the mailbox, uh, which is a mile down the road because mail doesn't come up here yet. We're like in a rural pocket, and so we don't have high fast speed internet. Mail doesn't come down here. Most, a lot of us have like little homesteads, you know, farming animals. Uh, I see goats and sheep and chickens and ducks. That's what I've seen. And then there's, of course, there's areas where I can't see them because you got to go farther down their road. But these are the ones off the main road here, which is not really a main road. <laughs> anyway, okay. So what was I talking about? Yeah. So anyway, i got to go check the mail. I'm expecting, it's supposed to be, oh, was that delivered today? Shoot. I might not get it today because it says it's delivery is today. So we'll see, because sometimes they'll put stuff in my mailbox. And sometimes they'll just leave the slip and I have to go down to the post office and pick it up. Um... So we'll see. And sometimes if we go down to the post office, it may or may not uh, be there because if it says pick up, you know, the next day. But because of the time, the mail person may have gotten back already and dropped off the stuff. Because usually I get off work at 3.30, so I get to my mailbox about four o'clock and then I, I have to get down to the post office before 4 30 because they close up that area well that sucks can't really tell the difference between the blue and the purple it's too dark oh well again live and learn um so i'm hoping the book will be there but it might not because if you know in the mailbox if the book is the same size, which I don't know, it's, um, what is it? 
inky. I don't know. It's the ivy and something. Now I can't remember the name of it. But anyway, that's the one that's coming. And then tomorrow I'm getting... Oh, some more Sakura pens. Because I don't have an orange one. And here I have ten. And then the ones I should be getting being delivered tomorrow are uh, 12. Alright, so now that I messed that up... <laughs> dang it! I should have tested it first, but I didn't think I didn't. So what else can I do? Um, what can I do with these flowers? I was thinking yellow, orange, red. But the red is pretty dark, a dark red. I wanted it to be bright. Maybe we'll try, we'll try one flower. Which flower? Mm. Mm. I guess we'll do this one. This is really tiny stuff, you guys, really tiny. So I'm hoping I can get that book today. Otherwise it'll be tomorrow. The pens definitely would fit in the box. But like I said, sometimes the stuff is in my box, sometimes it's not. Even though it could fit in my box. I guess it just depends. Well, usually it's just one person. Oh. Who's calling me? Benefits. I don't know. I'm just going to let it go to voicemail because I don't know who you are. It only rang twice. Usually it rings four times. That's interesting. Let's go. All right. I had such a gorgeous day out there. I got my planting done. I still have a raised bed. It's metal. My husband bought it for me. It was on sale at Tractor Supply. Um, I need to get it down because he put it on the porch for some reason. But I think I'm going to put it... It's not in the place I wanted to put it. My garden. My garden area is got stuffed parked in it and my husband bought a bunch of railroad ties and he's got those in that area too but I think there's a sunny area closer to the house that I'll put it and then I need to buy some more soil and I got stuff uh, some cucumbers, jalapenos, and what's the other thing? I oh, that's bouncing. I gotta stop. I mean, I'm bouncing. The it's leaning against my table, so so that doesn't look bad. Um, so I'll be closer anyway. Blue. I'm gonna get this blue. Maybe I'll do the blue here. I don't know. There. Do it on the side. Make sure it's not. Okay, I'll do these little. These little things. Uh, I have three things planted. Cucumbers. Jalapenos. Now who's going? I think it's my husband. Alright, I'll talk to you later. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. That was a message from my husband. It wasn't my husband. I don't know my husband's work number by heart. I mean, by looking at it. So I was thinking it was him. But it wasn't. It was someone 
in church to remind him uh, uh, men's fellowship tomorrow night. So I'll try to remember to tell him. <laughs> and then he's going to call him on the cell phone anyway. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's what, that's why I'm another, that's why I'm home. Because <laughs> there was supposed to be a women's, well, there was a women's retreat um, over the weekend. And I was going to go. But then I knew the weather was going to be wonderful and I needed to get my plants planted because we haven't, we've had constant rain and I haven't had a chance to get stuff done at all. So I did get it done and I stayed home to do it and so I'm home. But then this morning... It was 30 degrees. <laughs> so I just hope everything, everything looks alive. I, the ones I, what I worry most is the sweet potatoes and the potatoes. The potatoes are actually supposed to go in next month. Um, so, and this really isn't the place to be growing potatoes, but some people have luck, so. I thought I'd give it a try. So that came out pretty cute. And I got so much stuff on this table. I mean, I showed you pretty much what it looked like. There's stuff everywhere. Put this lid back on. So another thing I noticed, even though I love... These are my prismas. Even though I love flipping through them and finding the color I want, it takes a long time <laughs> because like, okay, I need the yellow. I need, oh, that's the wrong yellow. I need the, so I'm looking at the yellows, find out the right color I want. I just like having things out, all the colors. So, I don't know. I think I'll, I don't know. I like, it's so easy. <laughs> I do have a case a teal colored tape case and I think what I'm gonna do is put these puppies in it because it holds 72 pens and these are these are so soft and pretty like a, a, like I said I was watching Anne this morning and she was coloring using these pencils and so I think after I finish this page my next one would be with these pencils because they feel good um, I liked them just a little bit I played with them so I'm gonna give that a try in a picture I don't know which one so I think I'll put that in that teal case right now what's in there are what is in there? Stedler? Stedler pencils and some of the Mod Podge of stuff. But I think I'll put those in there. And then I mean I'm not sure about getting a case for that. Because right now I do have a case that holds 150 but actually it's full of my extra um, Prismacolors. Like I've said, I've bought, in, I've mentioned before, I've bought in different sets along the way until my husband bought me the 150. So I had a bunch of different sets, so I have a lot of extra, not all the colors, but a lot of extra ones. And so they're in the 150 case that I have. Um, yeah. All right, I think I'm going to do this. I don't know. I'm going to mess everything up, so what I'm going to do is going to look a mess like my stuff usually does. So anyway, this video 
will either be edited with this new thing I'm doing or I'll use the laptop and again I'm I'm thinking it has everything I need but I could be wrong maybe it doesn't but I think it does I don't know I never went and checked and I don't have it with me it's in the living room so I'm guessing either way this will go up um, I still have slow internet so it still takes hours for me to even upload anything to YouTube and then for YouTube to process it to get it out so what do you guys use do you guys do you guys have like cameras or I'm using my phone because I don't have a camera so do you guys have cameras or phones what do you guys use and what programs do you use to edit I know some people use Adobe Pro and I've looked at it and it's like um it looks too techy for me okay, I can hear the jacks and I get overwhelmed when things are a little bit until I know what I'm doing but I don't have anybody to show me with this program I can always get a hold of Mike from church and he can probably help me out with questions and things because like I said this is the program he's using for our church videos Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. So that's cute. I want to do this blue too. I need some more blue in here, so I'm going to do this little piece here. So my next video, I think I'm going to redo <laughs> the chicken one because I was showing people my chicks and the chickens and it turned out I didn't have the video on I thought I did but I was just snapping pictures and yesterday we sold when my son came over <laughs> that's right when he came over he's incubating eggs but then someone came over to buy some chicks for FFA. Um, they ended up buying five chicks. Two of them we had... Oh, did I mention this in one of my other videos? Some of them were born lame. It turned out like four of them were and two died. And we knew that they weren't going to make it. And then two others were getting along but they were lame. Um, I mean, they were eating and drinking and moving around. But anyway, she took those to try and help them. So they might do something with their feet. I mean, I tried doing that last summer. We had one. And I really tried you know, with the rubber bands and his feet and stuff and trying to get him to get straight. Um, he ended up dying anyway. That didn't, it didn't really help. I did, you know, I did what I could or knew how. Um, so yeah, so we have all the money that we, like we're selling, this any eggs we sell or any chickens we sell or chicks, um, we're keeping that money and we're putting it in a, container just you know saving it um, we're not going to make back our money for all the feed <laughs> and equipment because we ended up having to buy more feeders and more waterers um, let's 
So anyway, we're going to be doing that. So my next video, like I said, I'm going to do those chickens. I'll probably do that later today. <sighs> so I might get started on feeding the chickens before three. So, I mean, that came out cute besides this piece, which I really messed up. It should have been a lighter purple. And then that blue would have shown up better, too. So I messed up there. So this is going to take a long time. This didn't take long. I like how the, um, I don't know if you guys can see, but there's three or four different colors for on the leaves. And I just like the way the streakiness is because what I've noticed when I go out and look at leaves and look at flowers it looks perfect from far away but when you get up close you can see the imperfections even in the flowers and in the petals Skype is now enabled I don't have Skype I mean I'm not using it whatever um, I mean, there's flaws, there might be like a purple streak through it, but it might be broken in one petal or one flower or, you know, just broken or the shading doesn't go up as high. So that's why I like, it doesn't have to be perfect or smooth or anything because in, in reality, even leaves and petals and flowers, when you look at them, they're not even perfect, but the whole picture all together looks beautiful. And this would have been beautiful if I would have done that. And now I can't fix it. So anyway, guys, I will be working on this picture today. And I also need to put one more coat on this. But, I, you know, I still got dinner to fix and what I, the cleaning that I wanted to get done. I got the laundry done, but I was gonna sweep and mop the kitchen floor and my dining room table. I don't know if yours is like this, <laughs> but my dining room table is always a catch-all for everything because we don't sit at it unless we have company over because normally we just, we just make our plates and go sit in the front room and eat. So our dining room table just becomes a catch-all for everything. And so I was going to clean off that table. And the buffet also, because that's another catch-all area. <laughs> so anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.